what's up you guys welcome or welcome back to my channel so in this video today i did this blue uh, eyeshadow look it's something a little bit more fun and to achieve this look i used the amrezy palette by anastasia beverly hills so if you're interested to see how i came up with this look then just keep watching Alright, so jumping right into the video, all I have on my lips right now is the Too Faced Lip Injections Lip Gloss, and I just like to let that sit on my lips while I do my makeup. So today I'm going to be using the Amrezy um, Palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills, and this is what it looks like on the... Okay, this is what it looks like on the inside, and I'm not sure what type of look I'm going for today, but we'll see where it goes. So to prime my eyelids, I'm going to use the concealer. This is the Makeup Revolution Concealer in C10. Fix this So let's see, let me swatch some of these before I just go and apply them. So I'm going to start with the color New Yorker. <laughs> I feel like I just sounded so stupid say that. So New Yorker, that's how it's that's how it's spelled. I don't know. I feel like I don't have the right accent to say that the way it's supposed to sound. <laughs> New Yorker. Something like that, I don't know. So yeah, I'm just gonna use that as my transition shade. Transition shade. And I don't like to set my concealer just because I feel like when it's a little bit uh, like still tacky and drying that the eyeshadows stick better to it. Okay, so then on top of that shade, I'm going to go in with the color OG. In the pan, they look similar, but I just swatched them. I'll swatch them again so I can show you. So this is OG. And then this is New Yorker. So the OG is a little bit darker, so I'm just going to put that in there to deepen it up just a little bit. Ever so slightly. Okay, so after I have that blended out, <sighs> all right, so now that those are blended out, I'm going to go in with the color 1988, which is the brown color in the palette, and then I'm going to use that to deepen the crease even further, but more just in the crease, not above the crease. I washed these brushes and it's like, I think I messed it up. I don't know. I think I was too rough drying it, but yeah, this is not working. Okay, so let me see. Okay, for this look, I think I am going to cut my crease with some concealer. So I'm just going to use the same concealer I used before, and that's the Makeup Revolution Concealer in C10. My 
a lid shade, I want to use this shade Leo, which is this blue color here. Um, but I swatched it and it seems, let me see. So it doesn't seem like it'll be dark enough to completely like go on the way I want it to look. So I'm just going to take any blue color I have. And the first one that I seen was in the Celestial Thunder palette and it's just this. Uh, mystical ice blue color but you can really just take any blue shade um, yeah so I'm just gonna pack that on or you could even use a blue uh, um, eyeliner Alright, so that color is on, so now I'm going to apply the color Leo, and I think the best way to apply that is going to be with my finger, just because it does look like it has little specks of glitter in it. So now I'm just going to put on a wing liner and my mascara. Before I put on my lashes and do uh, my lower lash eyeshadow, I'm going to do the rest of my face and I'll be right back. So for my lashes, I'm going to use the House of Lashes Iconics. All right, so for my lower lash line, I'm gonna go in with this color here and it is called Simsa and I'm just gonna keep that close to my lash line so on top of that I'm like a little nervous because I'm gonna try something that I've never tried before and that's going to be putting a shimmer color on my lower lash line as well i usually only use mattes there but i'm gonna try it out and see what happens so i'm gonna go in with the color cupcake okay so this is what it looks like so far so i'm just going to add my lower lash mascara Alright, so just I'm um, gonna add a little bit of the brow enhancer on my inner corner just so the inner highlight could really pop. And I'm still still missing my NYX um, milk jumbo pencil. That's usually what I use for that. But um, the brow enhancer seems to work fine. So let's see inner corner color. Oh, okay. So for the inner corner highlight, I think I'm just going to go in with this color here, Wasted, which is just like a really pale pink shimmery color. Whoops, sorry. I stay like, I know when y'all be watching the videos, y'all just hear like a hell of stuff clashing and falling every time I sit something down or pick something up. So this isn't like sparkling as much as I want to, so I think I'm going to go in with Anastasia. So I'm just going to add my lipstick, fix my hair, and I'll be right back. Alright, so this is the finished look. And then for my lips, I just added MAC Spice Lip Liner. Then I put the ABH So Hollywood or Pure Hollywood liquid lipstick and then I just top that off with the Luxe lip gloss from ColourPop in 
tied up. And as far as the palette goes, I think it does have a lot of um, workable colors. It has a lot of nudes, some pinks, a pop of blue, some colors. So you really could go either way. You could do a more colorful fun look or you could even do a neutral look. Um, so I like that about it. It's very versatile and Anastasia Beverly Hills does make one of my favorite eyeshadow formulas. I used to like try to collect all her palettes. Not so much anymore, but I do still buy the ones that catch my eye like this one. So that's pretty much it for the video. Thank you guys for watching and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and click the notification bell so you can get um, a notification obviously when I upload a new video and thank you guys for watching. Bye.